What is the Swamp Thing? Welcome to Origins. We go over the origins of your favorite superheroes and villains. Today we're going to be looking at Swamp Thing's New 52 Reboot Restart. Now, Swamp Thing's origin is a bit odd, and this is because he's a large part of the elemental forces in the DC Universe. Swamp Thing is the avatar of green, which means that he is able to connect with all living plant life in the entire DC Universe. There is also the red, which is connected to all living beings, the clear, which is connected to all aquatic life, the gray, which is connected to all fungal life, and the rot. The rot is death. And they are always trying to stop the other kingdoms, while the elemental kingdoms themselves have always fought amongst themselves. It is an endless and eternal battle of red versus green, which is animals versus plants, gray versus red, which is fungus versus meat, and green versus rot, which is plants versus death. It's an endless and eternal battle. But today, we're going to be explaining the true champion of the green, Alec Holland. He was a scientist that was trying to create a formula that would help with the growth of plants. Alec always felt a particular connection to the green, almost like plant life was speaking to him whispering behind his back. This is because he was destined to become the avatar of the green, a swamp thing. The Rot knew this and their plan was to conquer the world, so they set forth to prevent Alec from ever becoming a new swamp thing. So the current avatar of the Rot, Arcane, invaded Alec Holland's home one night, murdered his wife, and stole her skin so it would look like her. The avatar of Rot then walked into his lab, gave him a hug, only to have him smile and tell her thanks for being you. It then started an explosion that destroyed all of the research and lit Alec's body ablaze. As his own flesh burned off his body, he ran into the nearby swamp. It extinguished the flames, but he was mostly dead. The green tried its best to reach into his system and change him, but it couldn't. The burns were far too severe, and instead he sank to the bottom as the rot began to take his body. The Parliament of the Green was at a loss, and they were unsure as to what to do next. They were in shock that they, the Parliament of the Green, couldn't save him. How were they so powerless to create their champion? But one of the members had an idea. They took the very essence of Alec Holland, and they created the first Swamp Thing. It was made entirely of plants and it had no idea what it actually was, because it thought that it was Alec Holland. It defended the green for years, and it did an amazing job, considering that it wasn't actually the champion. But eventually, it discovered the truth, and through a series of events allowed its own consciousness to flee into space where it could find a home of its own to live on. Luckily, the parliament was patient, and Alec Holland actually survived in the waters. He was simply in a coma. He awoke to become the true guardian of the green, and while initially he didn't want to do it, he finally understood what the green was. But he felt that he gave too much to it already. He gave his wife, he gave his life, he gave his research. He would give nothing more to them. This left the green itself vulnerable. And because of this, it was dying. Alec continued to ignore their cries, their pleas to become their savior. And when he eventually knew that he needed to do it, it was too late. They didn't have the strength left to turn him into Swamp Thing. But Alex still had the formula that he created so long ago. A super plant food. The parliament warned him that once he made the change, there was no going back. He would become Swamp Thing forever. But he was ready. So they took the vial and they broke it, swallowing the plant food and gaining a newfound strength. Just enough strength to change Alec into the greatest champion the green has ever seen. And he began his battle against the various elemental forces of the world. Now we are debating doing the actual New 52 run of Swamp Thing written by Scott Snyder, but we need to know if you guys want it. Give this video a like, and if it gets enough, we will get to it. It may be a few months, but we will get to it. Make sure you follow us on Twitter, at ComicStorian, Instagram, at ComicStorian, and Facebook, facebook.com backslash EligibleMonster. Don't forget to check out all the other videos on the screen right now, and I will see you guys next time, right here.